Hello everyone, Mr P here. So uh, first game I'd like to share with you is a game called The Bean Game. Um, it's a game used in a variety of scenarios. I use it quite a lot in gymnastics, uh, where it's a game based on uh, some balances, some shapes, some movements and some actions obviously, and also a little bit of fun for a minute as well. If you haven't done already, uh, please pause the video in a second and make sure you've got a nice clear space. For this game, you don't need to move around too much, but there's a bit of jumping up, lying down, moving around, etc. So you just need to have a bit of room to move around in. Right, I hope you've done that. So um, the idea of the game is I'm going to call out some different uh, beans. I'm going to go through a little demonstration with you to start with, uh, and then I'm going to call them out a bit faster so we warm ourselves up, and then we've got a little bit of a fun and, a, uh, and an adaptation at the end to make it a bit more interesting. So to start with, we're just going to start with a runner bean, so just jogging on the spot. Do each of the actions for about 20 or 20 seconds or so. So just jogging on the spot, making sure you're moving your arms and your legs, stiff your knees up. And then we have the jumping bean, it's just stand there jumping up and down. We've got a jelly bean, so just give the whole body a good shake, shake out your legs. And a chilli bean, it's quite chilly today, hence why I'm wearing the hat. And we'll have a couple of uh, balances and stretches with us. We've got a string bean, which will bring your arms up as high as you can in the air. Stretch up onto your tiptoes, as tall as you can be. We've got a broad bean, so nice wide stance, don't do the splits. Stretch those arms out, open up the shoulder blades. One of my favourite baked bean. I might disappear for a second. You've got to tuck yourself up as small as you can, like a tiny little baked bean. For those of you in gymnastics, obviously that's a star straight and tuck shape. Okay, we've also got a couple of interesting ones. We've got a, uh, a magic bean. Get your magic one, say abracadabra. We've got a French bean where you can take off your hat. I'm not going to do that. And say ooh la la. One of my personal favourites is a super bean, which is a T balance. You can balance on one leg, try and lean forward and make a T position. If I turn around to the side, hopefully you can see that as well. Excellent. Always get them just on the other leg as well. So I'm going to do a super bean. Woo! -hoo. There we go. So, if we're playing this game, if you're playing by yourself, I'm going to just call a few out now so you can get moving around, and then I'll tell you about the, the twist at the end. So if we start the runner bean, I'm a little frozen bean. Runner bean again. Frozen bean! Frozen bean. Yeah, everyone starts running the runner bean. And then we're going to do a string bean, tall as you can. Broad bean. And we do a bit faster, we go string bean. Broad bean. String bean. Broad bean. String bean. Broad bean. String bean. Broad bean. How fast can you do it? String bean, broad bean, string bean, broad bean, string bean, broad bean, string bean, broad bean, string bean, broad bean. And bait bean, as small as you can. And back a bit of jumping bean. Chili bean, magic bean, abracadabra, best Harry Potter spells there. Um, we got a French bean, ooh la la, and super bean. That's it, super bean. Now, what I like to also do with the children is I like to let them come up with their own. Uh, one of the children at the local schools I teach at always has a DJ bean. With get a bit groovy. Uh, a couple of the kids that are quite interested in Fortnite have some of the, the best mate beans and the dabbing beans and so on. And we always have some funny characters that comes up with a James Bond bean, a ballerina bean. So obviously as a family you can uh, take it in turns to come up with your own bean. Another thing you could do this game obviously if you're at home is you could write some down, put them into a hat and take it in turns to draw them out and take it in turns to perform them etc. Or even guess the bean where somebody chooses uh, something they want to be and then you have a go at uh, trying to guess which, which bean they might be if they're being a football bean or if they're being a karate bean or a surfing bean and obviously you can whoever then guesses then gets to take on a little bit like charades. Anyway, hope you enjoy the game and see you soon.